Hey guys, it's me, Fix73. Welcome to some more Battlefield Live on PC. We are playing Diffuse on Rogue Transmission, and I'm actually on my Alienware laptop right now. I did have my BF4 Live on my laptop series, but actually, it fits better into this series. But if you do want to check out um, the Alienware that I have, the specs will be in the description, along with the, uh, there is a 10% or something discount on Alienware products right now, so uh, make the most of that if you've been thinking about getting one. Anyway, let's get into the killing on the game, I have an Alienware M17, by the way, and that guy has some bullets in his face. Okay, so first kill in using the Type 95, really, really great carbine. I should probably put another med pack down here. It looks like this guy's actually assisting me in my little operation. Do I have the bomb? Oh, yeah, I have the bomb. So, there's a bomb site right over here. Although, so our teammates got wasted down at B. I'm going to make sure I'm in cover here. Wait, do I have it? Uh-oh. Planting from here. Uh-oh, I'm really open for the other building. This is really tense. So, uh, for those of you that don't know, Diffuse is just like the game mode Search and Destroy from the Call of Duty series. Oh, he's on that other roof there. I was going to get the guy who's sneaking up this side. Don't know if I'm going to be able to. Oh, the angles are not nice to me. I think there's someone up top. There we go. Caught him by surprise. And he's... <gasps> no! I took down three and got the bomb down. But, my... wait, is Kazish... I don't think Kazish spawned in. Oh, that is unfortunate. Wow. Okay, so this game is not going to be easy. We've got two level 100s on the enemy team. I dropped three in that round, but my team didn't drop any. Okay, rethink the strategy. Rushing is not going to work if uh, if I'm on my own. So, I'm going to also skip past the uh, kind of round loading times because they're really long. So, see you guys in just a moment. Here we go, round two, time for a slower tactic. I think I'm going to try and push up towards one of the bomb sites a little more slowly. However, I don't think the uh, building on the left with the A-bomb site is particularly easy to push up too slowly. The B-bomb site is probably a more suitable target to go for. I just don't want to get caught out on the way in. So if I hold this building right here, hopefully I'm going to be able to uh, spot some people to take down. So we're playing defense this time. It looks like my teammates are trying to push A. B's looking, oh, there's someone ahead here. Oh, I put shots into him. Let's get the regen as soon as that nade goes down. And yep, I spotted him. The assist counts as kill. How did he get up on there? I don't even know how you get up there. There's another down below somewhere. Where, where was, where did he come from? I don't even understand. Did he just run up the stairs behind him? He may have done, but hopefully I distracted those players enough for my teammates to do something. Come on, with that fam ass. No! Okay, here we go. He's, he's taking my spot right here. Have we got two alive? Okay, we've got Safer. And we've got Kazish holding the point. Although, you don't want to be going for long shots like that. It may slow them down. But I think it's going to be... Uh-oh. Oh, here we go. Come on, Mr. Eagle Eye. Come on. Shoot. Aim down sight. What are you doing? What are you doing? Aim down sight, please. Oh, dear. This is why I really do need to uh, find some fellow YouTubers to uh, squad up on this game with. But it looks like actually these two guys have got it unlocked even with all of that hip fire. So there we go. We took a round and uh, I got I got an assist. Counts as kill and a kill. And I distracted them. So uh, I'll take that. Now third round. What are we going to do? I'm just trying to think if I could get into that building there. Because we've rushed that building ahead. Um... What, what is it now? It's, it's twice in a row. So the enemy team are going to be expecting that. So if I can fortify up in that building, I could be good. Only thing is it's quite open to both construction sites. So they could just load it full of explosives and blow it to uh, smithereens. But I reckon my teammates are going to do the same thing. I'll leave the bomb to them. They actually did, well, technically they did better than I did with it. So uh, I won't be like, I'm the super soldier. Give me the bomb. I'm going in. I'll just uh, leave them to do their stuff. Okay, let's see if we can. This is actually quite a nice spot, but... That was some horrific shooting, got the kill. I need to get out of this area because my, uh, I'll be a little Dorito on the enemy minimap. Looks like bomb carrier's getting suppressed here. Let's see if I can hop up above and assist. Yes, nice long shot kill there. I was surprised I managed to pull that off with a carbine. This guy is, I got hit on him. He's still out there. Oh, uh, so yeah, my hands are still pretty freezing. It's cold in my room. I've only just woken up. So that is going to be my excuse for the misaccuracy then. Here we go. Now we're rounding up kills. I think I heard an enemy shouting around B. So the enemy team are definitely going to be playing defensively. They're going to be hiding. We're bringing the bomb round to A once again. I think I'm in quite a nice position here to, uh, 
to pick up anyone that tries to run across to the A-bomb site. Although I literally have no idea where they are. Okay. There we go. We got the kill. So what are we on? Seven and two. We took a hit on the first round. We're jumping up. So uh, three rounds, half time switching sides. I'll see you guys on the flip side. Okay, guys, so we're back in with switch sides, and I figured the match was going quite well. So I've decided to uh, pull out the pull out the sniper just for a round, see how sniping goes. So if I hold this building here, it has really nice visibility just across the map in general. So hopefully I can put that to uh, good use and drop a few of the enemy players before they even get to bomb sites. So first of all, let's take a look over the... Uh... So there we go, we've got... I couldn't spot that guy in time. That probably would have been quite useful for my team. Where are the enemy team? What are they doing here? I'm really open. They've got a spawn beacon. Why have you got that? It's uh, diffused. So... Looks like there's someone making causing havoc around this back side of the map. Um, okay, so he got killed right in that corner. I'm going to try just not to fall down the stairs. Uh, I'm going to try a grenade in that area. Because he just got the double kill. And he's probably still in that area. Oh, we hit him with that. Yes! Whoa! They are! Yes, the V40 mini is OP. My team got messed up on the other side of the map, though. Let's see if I can help out. We're outnumbered. Oh, no, we're not. It's 3-2. to two. I wish I could see what's going on over that side of the map. You know what? I'm going in. Into a... Straight into a dumper. I'm going for the quick zooms. Let's see what we can do. Okay. There he is. Uh-oh. I need to get a position where I can get a nice shot on. Oh, he's going around. Oh, this is this is not good. There we go. Bomb down. I will take that. And I was expecting that. I was expecting him to be nearby. I didn't know quite where. But I'll take two kills on the first round sniping. I wasn't in, you know, very good um, a very good situation for sniping. I think... I'm trying to think where it's worth going next round for sniping. Probably... Same building. I think the enemy team are going to play differently anyway because what they did there didn't work out too well for them. There, by the truck. Boom. Okay, so that's another round to us. I'll see you guys in the next one. Okay, it is time for one more sniping round and then the final round will go super aggressive with an assault rifle. So right here, I think it's probably worth... Now, we're going to mix it up. We're just actually just going to kind of stand around the middle of the map with a sniper because people will be looking for me up in the buildings. I just saw that guy go across there. Are we going to see anyone trying to get across that side? No. Doesn't look like it. Okay, we will actually need the height to pick off that guy behind the building. So it looks like he's going to try and do the same thing again. Would be my guess. I would. So we've got someone up on the top over there. And the question is, are they going to... You know what, that's it. I'm going for a better line of sight. Oh, you can go inside. Can you go inside? No, you can't go inside these buildings. Wait, we've got some... Okay, we've been taken out of A. This guy's down here. There we go. Quick shot on. And there's another out there. By the looks of things. Did he go up top? He did. And he's been dropped with the pistol. And it looks like we've got another... No, Claymore. What? Where did that... How did he plant the... Oh, I guess it took some... Oh, no. I would have got outside and tried to snipe the other guy across the hill. Hopefully, we did enough for the round anyway. Oh. Is it just... Oh, one, one guy left. Okay. Come on! There we go. He learned how to aim down sight. In fact, it was probably the other guy beforehand. He got really steady shots on that guy, though. The AK-12, when it comes to recall, is... Uh, ain't too bad. Oh, is he doing it? Is he going to do it big? No, he's not. He's, uh, he's not going to control that recall very well. Actually, we need this next round. So, uh, it's back to the AR. I'm happy with my 2-2 two and two being top of the team, just casually sniping that round. Got unfortunate with the Claymore. I think we would have had that round had there not been that Claymore. So we've jumped straight back in. And I'm trying to think which route is worth taking. If I'm going aggressive with an assault rifle. Probably looping all the way around and going under that building. Kind of sweeping all the way around. Because they usually attack that building first and move into that area. I don't know if this is going to work out. I really hope it does. Because I don't want to tie. I think I think it would just be a straight up tie if uh, if they win this round. Which is not what I want. We can do better than that. We deserve more. So this is going to have to be a nice round. Let's just hope I don't get caught out by anything like... I can hear an enemy. No. I'm... Oh my... How? How? That is... That's made me upset now. I think it could end up being a, a tie game here. 
That is really unfortunate. Oh, so unlucky. That's that's why I wasn't playing aggressively beforehand. There's that constant risk. This guy's getting shot from the side. Aim down sight. Throw a nade down there. Oh. Get the defibs out. Ooh, that's a cheeky revive there. That is a cheeky revive. The enemy team will not be expecting that. If I were them, I'd parachute down and go up behind the enemies. But they're not looking to do the same. Here we go. <laughs> no one's aiming down sight. No one's aiming down sight. I want another round, but I don't think it's going to be. If only I could have got the revive. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Is that it? Tie game. Well, there we go. That is it. I do hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure to leave a like, correct, and let me know what else you would like to see on Battlefield 4. Which weapons, which guns, which game modes, which maps, all that sort of stuff. Also, check out the Alienware link in the description, and I'll see you guys on my next video.